Hello then, uh, my good friends of YouTube. Yes, I'm in the uh, bedroom again, working on the bed. Uh, it's comfy, it's warm up here, it's quite crap outside today. It's uh, it's, it's, it's actually stopped raining now, but uh, it keeps throwing it down with rain, so it's quite cold now for this time of the year. Uh, yeah, summer's gone. Well, what summer we've had of it. But uh, yeah, I've come indoors because it's warm and I'm playing about with some good old flybacks got a load in from the shed I do like playing about with them just you know just like a lot of us are starting to uh, play about with the ZVS drivers and flybacks and I'm playing with a 5.5 timer because I like to be able to change the uh, you know the the, uh, the output with the potentiometers and I've actually found a couple of these at the scrapyard I didn't do a video of course and uh, you know because um, it was quite wet, I didn't really want to be videoing when it's uh, raining a little so but anyway, uh, this is quite, I found two of these exactly the same um, they're really old flybacks, I'm not quite sure what they were out of because they were already poured out of something and uh, they were just lying around in in some tub but um, I took the primary off because it was quite badly damaged so I took it off and put my own on and uh, unfortunately the, uh, the ferrite was cracked but um, you can still use these ferrites once you've uh, super glued them so uh, yes if it's a, if you've got a broken ferrite and you fly back don't worry about it just super glue it now make sure you clean the the injury up first and then uh, super glue it and it'll work just as good as it did before so uh, yeah so uh, I'm just chucking 12 watts through this uh, little load 5.5 timer circuit and um, getting quite a good outcome output from this uh, little flyback um, I've turned potentiometers right down to about a quarter of the way and um, I'm getting about an inch and a half arc so it's got, got quite a good little punch this uh, little old flyback um, so I'll give you a quick run of this and uh, just show you how good it works so where are we it's, I mean <laughs> we'll come back to that in a second I got oil on my uh, wife's uh, duvet cover from that because uh, I was running it for quite a while it got quite warm and oil was still in the uh, iron core and it run down onto the quilt cover and the wife didn't know so while she was at work I quickly threw it in the washing machine and dried it these are the things that happen when you start bringing stuff in from the shed working on the bed <laughs> so uh, keep hush about that guys because she doesn't know about that yes I did get the stain out thank god <laughs> so anyway let's get back to this and I'll show you this running you do get quite a good corona discharge from this as well. Look at this. Very powerful little flyback. I mean, it actually burns my fingers. It's quite powerful for its size. And very quiet. Interesting. Let's turn it up there.
And they're very fascinating though, aren't they, to play around with. I suppose some people watch these videos and think, what's the point of all this? The point of all this is to actually, just to see electric, just to see it work in the sound of it, the colour of it. Um, to be able to make your own your own arcs and I don't know what about what it is about it but unless you're really into it you don't really understand what's what the whole situation is about you know what the what's the point of doing all this um, unless you're actually into it I don't think you'll really understand you'll just look at it and think well I don't see the point in that but the people that do um, mess around with ZVS drivers and 5.5 time circuits with high voltage um, transformers as the potential trans, you know, the uh, the flyback transformer, sorry. Um, you know, there's, there's just something about it. So unless you're into this, then you won't fully understand. So that's what my point is about some comments that I've read on people's videos where they've been messing around with flybacks. And you know, performing their their own arcs, and um, all of us, you know, this whole community of, of friends on YouTube, um, the people that are actually into high voltage and are actually memorised by the arcs that these transformers give out. Um, there's just something about it, and they just I just feel like these these transformers, they just absolutely unbelievable I just I just love these transformers just like I've um, I mean I've it's like I've got into me x-ray transformers now and I really do love x-ray transformers I think they're awesome and I keep looking on eBay because I'm gonna buy myself some more because I just love x-ray transformers but my favorite transformers have got to be the flyback I absolutely adore and love flybacks. I think they're just awesome transformers. There's just something about them. I don't know what it is, but there's something because it's like a child with a toy, and these are my toys. It doesn't matter how old you are. At the end of the day, we all have our toys, no matter what shape or size or colour or whatever it is. At the end of the day, this is my toy, and I like playing about with them. So. So people who ever um, have to give a nasty or funny comment about what's the point in all this, unless you're into it, you're not going to know. So, but there you go guys, that's, my, that's me rambling on. And of course some of you will comment on, you know, the friends and supporters of, who, you know, sub, the, the su subscribers of you know, uh, I was on my channel and stuff, um, you will know and understand what I'm going on about. So, See how warm this is, and after all that, the the heat sink really isn't. It's just warm. That's what I mean about these transistors, these RFP two sixties, the ends. They're uh, really good transistors, MOSFETs. And for some of you that don't know what ZVS means, it means zero volt switching. So in other words, the uh, the MOSFET is is. is switching so fast that's what causes you know that's that's what enables it to run as as as, as good as it does because it's switching a voltage so quickly that it, it doesn't really have to do anything if that makes any sense <laughs> but anyway I thought I'd share that with you guys this awesome little flyback it's not hot it's warm not a little, not a bad little flyback so I'm going to leave you now and uh, let me get on with playing with my uh, flybacks. It's better than sitting and twiddling and fiddling around with your thumbs. <laughs> Alright guys, thanks for watching. Look after yourselves, be safe and we'll speak again.